As we all know, Cyberpunk was initially released in a less than ideal state, but some might not know about the 4 gigs that were cut from the game but are still in the files. These 4 gigs are actually being updated by CD Projekt Red to this day and will likely be added in a future patch release, or at least with time. The first gig, and by far my favorite, and the most interesting, is Desperate Measures and tells the story of Pedro a corp and very proficient netrunner who is trying to take over an automated Zeta Tech transporter, so he enlists your help to get it done. But you see, that's not the intriguing part. Pedro is a good man, but as you talk to him more and notice he is sitting in a wheelchair, you ask and he confirms that he has ALS, which for those of you who don't know is one of the few diseases yet to be cured in the cyberpunk universe. And as you can hear about on car radios from time to time, Pedro has found a black market dealer in the USSR that is willing to help him convert his mind into a new body for a fee, and Pedro needs to find the cash. The quest is super interesting because it touches on a lot of lore and backstory we don't hear about in the cyberpunk universe, and it's a shame it's not in the base game as of recording this video. Next up, Concrete Cage Trap is about a man named Tiny Mike who's being chased down by Militech agents. He's hiding out in an abandoned apartment building, and after figuring out one of many ways inside, you have to help him sneak or shoot his way out. You get him out safely back to the car, and Regina thanks you for your time. It's a pretty cookie cutter mission. The third gig, Hothead, tells the story of an NPC trapped by a Militech netrunner who has put a virus on their chip, allowing them to be traced constantly. You have to drive around the city defending your car from enemies while your assailant tries to get rid of the virus. Only thing is, no cars come to fight you and nothing actually happens. And that's because this quest probably stopped development after shooting cars in Cyberpunk was potentially removed as a feature and left in the game files only as a remnant for us to see to this day. And the final gig, Nasty Hangover is a request from Rogue to break into a warehouse and find Carl Gangsky, who was out drunk and got kidnapped by some Kang Tao operators because he has a chip in his head housing super confidential corpo secrets. So you break in and steal the chip and bring it back to Carl and either watch him get taken out by the company operatives or help him to keep the chip. Another pretty straightforward and quick quest. 